Hello everyone, Trentia here, and welcome back to Burst 93 FES. Today, the moon will be full. A powerful shadow will appear. The final battle is nearly upon you. You decide to stay home today and conserve your strength. Oh boy, I'm ready. Well, I will say my Odin does not have Thunder Rain yet, so I'll have to use the other method of cheesing the game. I found it. It's currently at the south end of the Moonlight Bridge. The twelfth and final shadow. Hmm. This is it. And as we expected, there are two Persona users nearby. Strega. They know this is their last chance. Even though we were expecting this, we should still be careful. Those bastards. <laughs> Saves us the trouble of looking for them. You've all done a fine job up to this point. This will be our last operation. Let's all come back safely. The final battle is here. The last shadow and Strago await you. Strategy weighs heavily on your mind as you prepare to select your allies. That's not true. I know exactly what I'm bringing along. Alright, so... We're gonna bring... Yukari, as always. Add to party. We're gonna be bringing Junpei. And we're gonna be bringing Akihiko. Hell yeah, I fucking love that. And well, that's our group. Let's... A go. Oh, can do, Mr. Akutsuki. Can do. The final battle has arrived at last. How many times are we going to say the final battle in the first two minutes? But first, there are two powerful adversaries you must contend with. Moonlight Bridge, South End. You know the significance of today, do you not? You claim you hunt the shadows to prevent the disaster they bring. Yet countless lives are lost each day without their intervention. The power we wield is not itself evil. You cannot deny that. So why don't you just admit it? You do not wish to eliminate the dark hour. You are merely deceiving yourselves. That's not true. Look within yourselves and you shall see. You are indeed foolish children. Erasing the dark hour is the same as erasing yourselves. <laughs> is even that beyond your comprehension? As I believed, our goals are irreconcilable. Jin. Forget these maggots. Fate shall decide who will prevail. Come. These two are serious. Fight hard. Ooh, okay, so they're dead last, which is great. Only problem is that I did kind of give Junpei the fire sword, so I have to be careful because Jin over there on the right uh, will repel Agi. So, as far as tactics go, I kind of just want to put everyone on support and heal, but there's also kind of a method to what I want to do, so I might just have to rush it a little bit. So, uh, yes, I have Thor equipped, and, well, this one right here on the tin, heavy luck damage and shocks all foes. Let's just fucking get this over with, shall we? Oh, uh, you're gonna use Mag Magrula, huh? I'm really hoping that someone would beat the shit out of them. So I'm gonna do this before Akiko's turn, so he punches them down. Please don't hit the same guy again. Please just go beat up Takaya next. I beg you. Akiko, you're a stupid son of a bitch, you know that? Son of a bitch. 
I'm gonna laugh when I do this in portable because it's gonna be over in one turn anyways. I never imagined that your power would rival ours. Astonishing. Perhaps I misjudged your strength. Nice try, dude. Fuck it. I'll do it again. I'm I'm gonna this is essentially the same thing as solo ulting in like Overwatch or something. I'm just going to solo ult to Kaya. This can't be. So technically speaking, Takaya is maybe the harder the one you should maybe take out first. Uh taking out Jin first is my personal preference because he's a he looks like an asshole throwing that grenade around. Uh, but Takaya does have Megiddo and Mind Charge, so not great. Anyways, 14k experience, not bad, but I didn't level up. Damn it! Is their power that different than ours? Different. For us, it's not that simple. It has to be forced out. Didn't your pal tell you? So it was you who was giving Shinji those pills. You guys don't have the slightest clue what will happen if the Dark Hour disappears, do you? It won't matter for normal people since they don't remember anything anyway. But for us... That's enough. Now then, ordinarily we'd withdraw, but not tonight. This body, as ephemeral as it is, it is worthless without my power. Therefore, only one choice remains. I shall prove my existence here and now. What are you doing? Don't be so reckless! Jin? Sorry. But those are your words, not mine. You win. Looks like you'll get your wish. Go do what you came for. Wait! I'd rather die than surrender to you. Take a good look. This is how we live. Jin and Takaya disappeared into the blood red sea below. They jumped. What the hell were they thinking? They chose their own fate. Don't let it phase you. The operation has only begun. Our true adversary is waiting. Focus on that, all right? Yeah, that shadow up there. <laughs> you, you don't you don't get this in portable, I don't think. Maybe you do. I mean, you have to, right? I just wasn't paying attention, but that's very cool. No, wait, you wouldn't because this wouldn't be in 3D. It's 2D. Yeah, I mean, what the fuck? I mean, that's the last shadow right there, looking cool as hell. Anyways, we're switching out our party members a little bit. We're adding in Korumaru and replacing Yukari. And we're grabbing Ken. And in place of Akiko, we'll be Ken. Uh, this is mostly just to cover weaknesses. Uh, anyways, can I just walk forward? Yeah. Let's do this. Final shadow. This is it. I'll do everything in my power to help you. Just promise me that you'll be careful. I love the twisted moonlight bridge. It's so cool. I think that floating thing is your main target, but 
It's out of your attack range. Give me a minute. I'll see what I can find out. All right, so we're going to start this one off by setting Junpei to uh, heal slash support. And then Ken and Koromaru are going to be on full assault. Uh, Thor is literally the only thing you need for this fight because you will be able to not take damage from the, sh uh, the main shadow at all. So we're just going to go ahead and throw a Masuku Kaja to get everyone's thing up. And then the next turn, we will deal with this boss probably. Because yeah, as uh, Fuka said, we cannot hit the shadow until we get rid of the statue. Are you not going to use Agonine? I mean, I guess it makes sense. Oh, that one blocks it, huh? <laughs> oh, nice. So, actually, this is perfect because now he falls. We get a free all-out attack. Oh, he's in a god's hand? Use it on me. Oh, he's going to Ken. Oh, that barely hurt him. So, now I guess I'm just going to put everyone on full assault. Because I'm going to do a fun little thing called absolutely cheese the fuck out of the game. I don't even feel bad. So yeah, we just do this and then everyone's going to attack. Everyone's going to cause an all-out attack. This fight will be over. Oh, wait, no, I need to rush Ken's turn. Junpei is the exception. Oh, it, okay, it didn't knock him down, knock him down. That's right, it's only when he falls down you get all attack. Um, but for Junpei, see how he's using one of these uh, magical weapons? Uh, sometimes that doesn't cause the all or thing, but then again, looks like he didn't get knocked on anyway, so maybe it wouldn't be fine. I don't know. I'm talking out of my ass right now. Um, we really don't need that, but whatever. We will just use Vicious Strike and hopefully kill all of them in one go. There they all go in one go. And then he falls off the hooks. Oh, no, he doesn't. I wish. Here's a chance. Let's get him. We can take him off the hooks by force. And he's done for. Ooh, nice another 14k. There we go. Level 72, 8k to 73. Loving it. Right, and there's Thor leveling up. The workhorse. Incredible. Is it over? Operation completed, or should I say, mission complete. Yes, it's finally over. I believe a celebration is in order. What will be our victory cheer? <laughs> I want to say, can we go home now? Because it's funny. But I'm going to have to go with Hip Hip Hooray. One, two, three. Hip, hip, hooray. <laughs> what was that? So, uh, Senpai, you're gonna throw us a party tomorrow, right? <sighs> you don't waste any time, do you? Well, I suppose I could arrange for it. Ooh, in that case, how about sushi? Sushi, huh? It's been a while. Well, I've got dibs on the halibut and sea urchin. Oh, then I call the fatty tuna. Um, we're divvying it up already? In that case, save me the salmon roe. Hey, wait a minute. You can't do that. I reserve the shrimp, squid, scallops, and sea eel. Hey, that's not fair! You don't even eat! You should all be ashamed of yourselves, fighting over sushi. Senpai, please order tamago for me. They say you can tell a chef's skill by how he prepares eggs. Um, how old are you again? 
Okay, okay, I'll have the very best delivered tomorrow. For real? Oh man, it's great to be alive. Don't get too excited, Junpei. You're getting the leftovers. What? Well, but it was my idea in the first place. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it's time to say goodbye to the dark hour. Even though it seemed like a curse, for some reason I'm reluctant to let it go. Yeah. We really did it, didn't we? Yes. We saved the world, even if no one knows it. The battle is over. The dark hour has come to an end. Now it's time for us to eat some gosh dang sushi. Who cares about anything else? It's sushi time, baby. Good morning. Uh, yo. This is the first time we've talked during the daytime. True. Nice weather, isn't it? This is indeed a new day for both of us. All the fragments of my memory, they finally come together. I now know my role clearly. The time has come. As difficult as it may be, I must tell you something. I am afraid this is goodbye. I want you to know, for me, our friendship was a miracle. But miracles don't last forever. If only they did. Yeah. I shall treasure our conversations always. Even if today is the end, the bond between us can never be severed. Remember that. It was fun while it lasted. Farewell. Thou art I, and I am Thou. The bond Thou hast nurtured hath finally matured. The innermost power of the Death Arcana hath been set free. We bestow upon Thee the ability to create Thanatos, the ultimate form of the Death Arcana. Arcana. Yo, do you ever seen the Death Arcana? I don't know why that came out there. Yes, the Mysterious Boy Social Link is maxed out. The Forge Bond cannot be broken. So we can now fuse Thanatos, the Bringer of Death. Whatever. Get out of here, kid. It's sushi time. Well, after school, I guess. Oh, it must it must have been ready? Heck yeah. Same here, brother. I haven't eaten anything since yesterday. Oh, no, we'll, we'll become a mech right after school because there's no reason to do anything today. And it's because we can't. We're forced into this. Class has ended for today. There's going to be a celebration at the dorm. You should head back. Whoa, nice spread. Oh, the slices are huge! Man, I'm starving. Can we eat? Hey, where are Aiga's son and Akutsuki son? Ah, he took her to the lab for a tune up or something. He said they'd join us later. <laughs> the chairman just can't stay away from the lab, can he? Be my father. We've been waiting for you. So, it's over at last, huh? Yes. 
Congratulations, everyone. You've done well. There are no words to express my gratitude. Though you will never receive the recognition you deserve, it is undoubtedly a monumental achievement. Thank you. To you, I owe a special thanks for lending us your power until the very end. Oh, it's... it's no big deal. The Twelve Shadows that were the cause of all our troubles have been destroyed thanks to your efforts. You needn't bear this burden any longer. You deserve a chance to experience the joys of youth. The specialized extracurricular execution squad will be dissolved as of midnight tonight. No longer must you put your lives on the line in battle. Tomorrow, you can triumphantly return to a normal school life. Is something the matter? Oh, it's nothing. Alright everyone, it's time to celebrate. Your feast awaits you. There is no need to hold back. Eat as much as you'd like. Sweet! I've been waiting for you to say that! Well, we're, we're ranking up before sushi? Come on now! Yeah, so that's rank 7 for the Seas team, even though we're going to be dissolved at midnight. What's the point of a rank if we didn't even max it out? And, uh. Now listen up, everyone! I, I have an idea. How about we all take a picture? Actually, I tried to take one last night. But I forgot it wouldn't work during the dark hour. You mean, you brought a camera with you into battle? Well, it, it was our last battle, after all. Hey, uh, could you take our picture? I feel like such a tourist. But I have to admit, I kind of want a picture, too. Oh, wait! Kutsuki san and Agus aren't here. I guess we'll have to take another one later. All right, everyone get together. Is everyone ready? You bet. Knock it off. On. Quit fooling around, Junpei. Uh, hey, knock it off, will ya? Hey, how come nobody's eating? Don't tell me you're full already. Are you kidding? I'm stuffed. <laughs> Me too. Ugh, I couldn't eat another bite. How about you, senpai? It's not good for now. All right. Oh, hey, hungry boy. Don't give the dog raw fish. You'll make him sick. What's taking those two so long? It's almost midnight.
the hell? I thought we ended the dark hour. Senpai, what's going on? I don't know. Apparently I was right to have my doubts. Yeah, something didn't feel right. Hmm. No way. Hey, do you hear that? It sounds like a bell, but where's it coming from? Where is Ikutsuki? Well, why is he late? He's got Igis with him, doesn't he? Mitsuru. Everyone, prepare for battle. We're heading for Tartarus. Um, to do what? I don't know, but that's where the sound is coming from. We have to find out what's going on. Ikutsuki-san! I guess? Why are you here? She is here merely to fulfill her role. As a weapon. Huh? Ikutsuki-san, what's this all about? You said the Dark Hour and Tartarus would disappear if we defeated the Twelve Shadows. That's why we fought so hard. But now... What is your intention? It was all a lie, wasn't it? You knew from the beginning that the Dark Hour wouldn't disappear. Excellent deduction, Mitsuru. Unfortunately, your realization has come too late. No. You tricked us? Everything is as I planned. It is not unexpected that the Dark Hour and Tartarus remain. In fact, I never intended for you to rid the world of them. Quite the opposite, actually. What do you mean? The Twelve Shadows were parts of a whole. They were destined to be reunited. And that was accomplished in no small part, thanks to your efforts. Soon, death, the Almighty, shall arise and bring forth the fall. Death? What are you talking about? The end of all shall come and free this world from despair. The death of everything, but also the beginning. What is he saying? Is he out of his mind? Ten years ago, I too was a scientist for the project we've spoken of. The experiment went awry, but that is not why the Dark Hour and Tartarus were born. They manifested as a result of harvesting the Shadow's power, just as the experiment was designed to do. That is why your grandfather gathered so many shadows, to bring about the fall. That can't be. People have filled the world, yet turned it into a void. The only hope of salvation lies in ruin. According to the prophecy, the fall will be orchestrated by the prince. And once the prince has delivered us all, he shall rule the new world as king. The man who tried it ten years ago failed, but I will not. I shall succeed. Man, he's totally lost it! I apologize for deceiving you, 
but this was for your sake as well. If you follow me for just a little while longer, you too will find salvation. You call that salvation? I have a question for you. Yes? In the video from my father, he said to defeat the shadows. Was that a lie too? Ah, he did record that himself. Of course, I had to make some modifications. You doctored it? I corrected it. Your father was a superb scientist. He may not have known it, but I truly respected him. While others focused on the shadow's abilities, he explored much more important things. But unfortunately, he could not comprehend the magnificent potential of the fall. What? He left that recording at the expense of his life. It would seem so, but it did prove rather useful, so I'm sure he's happy. So you were behind it all? You used both me and my father. Used is such an ugly word. It was for the sake of the world, so how could it be wrong? Our role is to correct the mistakes of the past, and we intend to do just that. Hey, wait. Oh, how disappointing. I had hoped you would see the light. But you are just children after all. I suppose it can't be helped. I guess the time has come for you to fulfill your role. Capture them and prepare them to be sacrificed. Understood. What is going on here? What the hell? What is this? <gasps> Father! Ikutsuki, what is the meaning of this? It is just as it appears. They are to be sacrifices, harbingers of the fall. The arrangements are complete. The prophecy shall be fulfilled. What? You son of a bitch! I'm gonna rip your head off! <gasps> you traitor. Are you insane? Of course not. You know your father was an unlucky man. Even you, his son, after all this time, do not understand his vision. My father was wrong. Death is a deliverance. That is not an ideology anyone should ever embrace. Fool! You are but a nuisance now, I guess. What are you doing, I guess? I am. <sighs> uh. Ten years. I've wasted ten long years. I'm not like your father. I won't make any exceptions. Father! Father! 
I guess we will end this. Execute the sacrifices now. I guess. What the? Damn it, you! You defective machine! I'll do it myself. What the? You are! You don't get it, do you? This useless, pathetic world will gradually fester over time. Only its destruction can bring about its salvation. And then, at long last, I will rule over the new world. <laughs> I was so close. <laughs> How did it come to this? One time my father made a promise. He swore that he would atone for endangering our generation, even if it cost him his life. But I... I wanted him to live. I... I became a Persona user to protect him. Yesterday was a shocking turn of events. You wonder if Mitsuru Senpai is alright. You wonder what else the future holds. Ooh, that was loaded. Absolutely loaded. Uh, I wonder what we're going to hear today. Uh, what are we hearing? Uh, illness, huh? Yeah, I bet. Well, feels like with Shinji. Terrible trash hand, but you gotta go to school still. No rest for the wicked. Oh, there we go. The phones are ringing. Tamakiko. Need to talk to you all. Meet me in the command room when you get home. room has been cleared out. Well, that's no surprise, considering what he did. I just can't believe all this. It's in the papers, too. Sudden death of Kirijo's group CEO. They blame it on illness, though. Yeah, it's never the truth. Mitsuru Senpai's not here, huh? She's an only child, so there's a lot of matters to be settled, including the funeral and the family business. I'm sure she'll be busy for at least a week. That sounds rough. I hope she'll be okay. So, what are we supposed to do now? What'll happen to Chidori? 
No word yet. They're probably too busy to be thinking about that. In fact, the entire Carijo group must be in a state of shock. I hope I guess is all right. What the hell? Am I just supposed to wait for them to get their act together? Mitsuru is meeting with the board of directors, and that might explain the delay. I see. But still, what are we going to do? We have no idea how to get rid of the Dark Hour. We don't even know what we're fighting against. What was that he said about the fall? What would have happened if we'd been sacrificed? There are so many unanswered questions. Yeah, but standing around here won't solve anything, right? Mm, true. But there is one thing we know. Tartarus is still around, and there's a bunch of shadows inside it. We should train so we're ready for whatever it is we might have to face. Yukari-chan. Um, there were traces of a video on the chairman's hard drive. Most of it was deleted, but I was able to restore some of it. I thought you might like to see it. Thanks, Fuka. I'll watch it later. I pray that this recording reaches safe hands. That video? My employer has become obsessed with a loathsome idea. And this experiment should have never even been conceived. That's why I had to interrupt it. However, in doing so, I set free a number of shadows that are certain to torment future generations. But if I hadn't, the entire world may have paid the price. Please, listen carefully. I cannot stress this enough. You must not hunt the shadows that have dispersed. Huh? This part's... I wasn't able to stop this madness. He won't listen no matter what I say. He's under the devil's spell. Now the shadows are trying to eat one another. But if they're reunited, then we are all doomed. I'll say this once more. Leave the shadows be. This is the original video. Before Ikutsuki changed it. Dad tried to stop the experiment. There's not much hope for me now. I have just one favor to ask. Whoever finds this, please, give my daughter Yukari this message. I know I promised I'd be home soon, and I'm sorry to break that promise. But I want you to know, Daddy was the happiest man on Earth when he was with you. I love you, Yukari. Please, take care of yourself. Dad? Dad? Daddy? <laughs> I know one thing for sure now. I was right to believe in him. Are you listening, Dad? I'm doing okay. It took a while, but I finally got your message. The resolution in Yukari's heart has awakened a new persona. Yeah, how about that hard panned right explosion? <laughs> Io has given rise to Isis. Uh oh. I'll fight for what I believe in. That's what you would have wanted. Right, Dad? Yeah, let's just go to sleep.
Welcome. As I'm sure you are aware, you are currently in a dream. Now then, there has been a change in you recently. Have you noticed? And I am not referring to your change in circumstances. I am referring to the change in your mentality. That is why I have summoned you here tonight. Going forward, there is one thing you mustn't forget. It is the contract you signed. I see you recognize it. Shall I remind you of your commitment? I chooseth this fate of mine own free will. There is no need to worry. Whichever path you choose, I shall respect your decision. However, only you will bear the responsibility for your actions, no matter what end they may bring about. Please, remember that. Well then, I bid you farewell. Well, it's now the sixth. This game it's just like it just never stops. This, this whole episode has felt like I've been recording for two hours. Yo, Chidori. Sorry about not being able to come lately. Uh, a lot's been going on. Hey, what's wrong? So you heard about Takai and Jen, huh? I was planning on telling you. They were your friends, after all. What? That's not it? I'm scared. It hurts. Junpei, what will you be doing in two years? Two years? I don't know. I really haven't thought about it. Why do you ask? Hey, I, I noticed you stopped, you know, uh, hurting yourself. Oh, I guess. That's good. I mean, you have such beautiful hands. <gasps> Don't touch me! Oh, uh, sorry. I, I didn't mean to... This is too painful. It used to be fun when you came to visit. But it's different now. Huh? It hurts inside. I can't breathe. I... I can't take this anymore. W what do you mean? I... I don't understand. D did I do something wrong? Tell me what it is. Junpei... Don't come here anymore. But... Uh, Chidori... All right, so class is over. Uh, I'll talk more about what that scene we just saw uh, next time, because there's going to be a whole thing with that. Uh, oh, wow. Yeah, wow, a whole lot happened. The uh, final full moon, full moon operation. Uh, Akutsuki turned out to be the poisonous flower in our thing or whatever the heck Pharaoh said. And uh, wow, yeah, Mitsuru's father being killed, uh, Koromaru being the MVP, grabbing the remote from Akutsuki, uh, Kutsuki being a complete fucking nut job. Uh, tomorrow, next time, whatever, we're going to Tartarus. So I'll see you then.